Uh, afternoon first, afternoon in castingweatherwatcher.com. Um, I have got a bit of a sore throat today and also a bit of a headache, so do pardon me if I have to take a few moments away from the video to cough and sneeze. Uh, this is the current wind situation across the country. Um, sort of a straight westerly wind here, bringing showers out, but rain across many parts of the country. Um, gusts of wind to perhaps 30 mile, 40 mile per hour across western areas of the country, indeed, this afternoon. Looking at the current, wind, uh, the current rain situation then, um, heavy showers currently packing into western parts of the um, England, Northern Ireland too. This more general rain across eastern parts of the country will spread eastwards and will spread these heavy showers into many parts of England and Wales. These could be torrential in one or two areas. Uh, this is the forecast of rain situation going out towards the end of next week. Heavy rain in many parts of the country, some very torrential conditions for the middle part of May. Um, anywhere between 25 and would you believe it, 100 millimetres of rain across many parts of the country as we go through towards the end of next week. So some very wet conditions coming up. It's not just the UK that are bathing in the very wet conditions through next week. It's also many parts of northern Western Europe stretching all the way from um, um, Western Norway and Sweden, stretching up all the way through towards France, the low countries, and indeed Turkey. Um, so very wet conditions coming up for much of your northern and northwestern Europe in the next few um, days and weeks. Uh, this is the ECMWF forecast for tomorrow. Uh, you can see that we've got area of low pressure set up across many parts of the country, bringing these wet conditions. A brief nose of high pressure here will tend to settle things off to go through towards Sunday, but many parts of the country are in unsettled conditions, and as we go through towards next week, well this is for um, Wednesday next week, well low pressure very dominates itself up then across many parts of the country bringing in the wet conditions, and that stays with us as we go through towards Saturday and end of next week to next weekend, we do keep these unsettled conditions with the risk of strong winds in places, and by the time we go through towards the start of next um, the start of the week after next, there is a hint here of perhaps high pressure developing across western parts of the country, and as I say this could uh, bring in more settled, more settled conditions, so better conditions as we go through towards um, 20th, 22nd of May, but there is still a lot of uncertainty, so do stay tuned to the forecast. Overall, then, it's not looking fantastic. Many parts of the country engulfed by heavy rain with low pressure nearby as we go through towards next week. Strong winds, too, especially to start off with northwestern parts of the country and perhaps the eastern parts of the country as we go through towards the end of the forecast period. Um, there is a risk here of some very heavy rain across many parts of the country uh, with flooding inevitable in one or two places. So thanks for tuning into the forecast. Um, do keep yourself updated with all of the UK weather updates by going straight forward to castingsweatherwatcher.com and you can get all your forecasts there. In a few moments, we will be having the five-day forecast Forecast come up, um, so do stay tuned to that forecast that are coming up between 2 and 3 pm. So do stay tuned for that one, uh, looking very settled with a more detailed look at weather um, in the United Kingdom for the next five or so days and day to the changes. So thanks very much for watching the forecast, looking very settled for the UK. And um, if there is any very severe weather coming up or a chance of uh, flooding in places, I will give an update on my weather aware page in this coming week. So do stay tuned for that one and do keep yourself updated there. So thanks very much for watching and see you later.